Hey guys, welcome to the tut in the tutorial of SolidWorks. So today we are going to see that how can you uh, see whether your assembly has interface like interference or clearance. So if if your assembly has interference, so that that is not required in assembling part. And how can you detect that uh, error, like the the interference or clearance in your in your assembly? So as you can see here, uh, I made an assembly and I created an interference between these two parts. So as you can see, let me open this um, file where I have created this part. So this is a part, like the part one. You can see that and like the diameter is 100 for this. And for this, you can see that uh, from centered like this is the 2020 like these two cylindrical parts the, out, the parts which are coming has diameter of 20 and the distance from the origin is given so this uh, the this cylindrical part has diameter of 20 so now this is the first part now open the second part and let's see what we have dimension so as you can see here again the base has diameter 100 but now this holes it has diameter of 80 so it's going to be an interference fit okay so and i made the assembly which is already open and you can see my assembly video where i show you that how can you make the assembly so after making all this you can see that here there is some interference created because the the, the holes as smaller diameter compared to this cylindrical um, joint part so how to check whether it has interference or clearance so for this if you go to this evaluate so this is the first uh, if you do assembly you will get this assembly part assembly options now for that you need, you need to go to evaluate here you can see interference reduction click on this you have chosen the assembly one is shown by this box this, the chemical box is cover all the assembly parts and click on calculate so you can you can hear that you get the sound that means that interference and this is the volume of interference like 1790.71 mm cube so that's the interference volume and it is shown by this red part this is this is for this first hole and this is for the second hole so you can you can see that uh, what's your interference and similarly for if it has clearance but here it is it doesn't have the clearance so if it has clearance you can check it from clearance verification if you click on this you need to select these two component click on calculate and here it says that it is either coincident or interfer interfering that means there is no clearance but if it has clearance you can see here you can get the value of clearance here but it doesn't have clearance now so we are, we are not going to get any value so in this way you can get the clearance and verification uh, interference and clear uh, and clearance details using these two options in your assembly and this is very useful if you are assembling any important parts so that uh, that part can can't get over like over dimension or under dimension in this way so if this video will be helpful to you like my video and subscribe my channel thank you